Hey, what's going on? Um, so I made this little flywheel box. Wanted to kind of do like a brief overview on it. And uh, you can see the design here. It's kind of just a, a piece of plywood across the top. Uh, two pieces of plywood, actually, <laughs> across the top. And then uh, we got two flywheels. I actually stuffed a, uh, a five pound plate in there. But uh, it's real simple. It has uh, a rope. It's 50, it's pulley right here. That I have attached to uh, a curl bar. It's got a rod going down. Uh, all the little lock nuts that are in here to basically act as spacers between the rod and the wood. And you can kind of get a good look at it there. But uh, I have set this up, just a little inertia box. So ideally, I've got this cleat outside here that runs through the box into the shaft. And then on the shaft, obviously when it starts to pull, it goes all the way through and starts to rewind itself back up. You can kind of see that mechanism happening here. So once you give it a good pull, it then goes the other way, pulling back down and then up and around and it just laces itself forward and back, forward and back, forward and back. So underneath, we got these pillow block bearings right here and both of those onto a two by four. We got the four by four for the legs and then that rope, like I was saying, we have the cleat coming across here, goes up, up to the handle and then around the shaft. The shaft has a hole drilled through it that my rope is actually running through. So you can see that there. It's tied around with the knot and uh, sealed bearings. That's pretty much it. These flywheels, I actually ordered these and I had to drill the holes through the center myself, but basically these are uh, quarter inch thick. One is nine inches, one is seven inches, if I'm not mistaken. And they are targets, like uh, shooting range targets that I ordered and just drilled a hole through the middle of them, bolted it on there, and now we have a flywheel box. So I think I'm gonna create another design. Uh, I've seen some other iterations that I kind of like and I'm gonna play with. And so I'll keep you updated and, and post those once we get it up and running.